So what are soil bacteria? Well, they are single-celled microorganisms found abundantly in the soil. They are essential to soil fertility and plant health, comprising diverse species with various functions. Let's talk about the types of soil bacteria. First, we have decomposers. They break down organic matter, recycling nutrients back into the soil. Next, nitrogen fixers convert atmospheric nitrogen into forms plants can use. Nitrifiers convert ammonia into nitrates, making nitrogen available to plants. Then, denitrifiers reduce nitrates back to nitrogen gas, completing the nitrogen cycle. We also have pathogens that harm plants by causing diseases and symbionts that form beneficial relationships with plants such as rhizobium with legumes. Let's look into the functions of soil bacteria. Nutrient cycling. Bacteria play a pivotal role in breaking down organic matter, releasing nutrients such as nitrogen, phosphorus and sulfur, essential for plant growth. Organic matter decomposition. Decomposer bacteria degrade dead plant and animal material, enriching the soil with humus and improving soil structure. Plant growth. Promotion. Certain bacteria produce growth-promoting substances, enhance nutrient uptake and protect plants from pathogens. Soil structure. Formation bacteria produce polysaccharides that help bind soil particles together, enhancing soil aggregation and stability. Now, let's talk about the factors affecting soil bacteria. Soil pH influences bacterial diversity and activity. Most bacteria thrive in slightly acidic to neutral pH between 6 and 7. Soil moisture. Adequate moisture is crucial for bacterial activity, but waterlogged conditions can reduce aerobic bacterial populations. Temperature bacterial activity increases with temperature up to an optimal point beyond which it declines. Organic matter content. High organic matter provides energy and nutrients for bacteria, boosting their populations and activity. Soil texture. Soil texture affects aeration and moisture retention, influencing bacterial habitats and functions. Enhancing soil bacterial activity is crucial for maintaining healthy soil ecosystems. One effective method is the use of organic amendments. By adding compost, manure or other organic materials, we can significantly boost bacterial populations and activity, providing essential food sources. Another strategy is crop rotation and diversity. Rotating crops and using diverse plant species enhances soil health by supporting a variety of bacterial communities. Furthermore, reduced tillage helps preserve soil structure and bacterial habitats, leading to healthier soil ecosystems. Planting cover crops also plays a vital role. It protects soil from erosion, adds organic matter, and supports beneficial bacteria. However, it's important to avoid the overuse of chemical fertilizers and pesticides, as these can harm beneficial bacteria. Whenever possible, opt for integrated pest management and organic fertilizers to promote a thriving soil environment. Monitoring soil bacterial health involves regular soil testing, which can provide crucial information on pH, organic matter content, and microbial activity, all essential for guiding soil management practices. Additionally, biological indicators such as the presence of earthworms, a rich humus layer, and vigorous plant growth can also indicate healthy bacterial activity in the soil. So, what are the roles of common soil bacteria? Nitrogen-fixing bacteria like rhizobium form nodules on legume roots, fixing atmospheric nitrogen, while azotobacter are free-living bacteria that fix nitrogen directly in the soil. Decomposers such as bacillus break down complex organic materials, and actinomycetes decompose tough plant residues like cellulose and chitin. On the other hand, Pathogens like Pseudomonas and Xanthomonas can cause plant diseases, such as bacterial spot in various plants. Additionally, symbiotic bacteria, mycorrhizae, form fungal bacterial associations that significantly enhance nutrient uptake in plants. Now, let's look at some case studies and practical applications. In the realm of sustainable agriculture, 
farms that utilize crop rotation, organic amendments, compost tea and cover crops often report improved soil health and increased crop yields. Urban gardening too shows promising results with community gardens employing compost and reduced tillage practices, experiencing robust plant growth and fewer pest problems. Innovations in soil bacteria research have led to bioremediation techniques that use bacteria to clean up contaminated soils and the development of biofertilizers, bacterial inoculants that enhance plant growth and soil fertility. Understanding and managing soil bacteria is essential for sustainable agriculture and environmental health. By supporting beneficial bacteria through organic practices, reducing chemical inputs and monitoring soil health, we can enhance soil fertility, promote plant growth and protect our ecosystems. Some actionable tips include testing soil regularly to monitor pH, organic matter and microbial activity, using organic amendments like compost, compost tea or extract, worm compost extract, manure or cover crops to boost bacterial populations. Practicing crop rotation to maintain a diverse bacterial community. Reducing tillage to minimize soil disturbance and protect bacterial habitats. And limiting chemicals to avoid overuse of pesticides and synthetic fertilizers. By following these practices, you can create a thriving soil environment that supports robust bacterial activity, leading to healthier plants and more sustainable agriculture.